My name is Brent Stabener and I'm a consultant with Logan Consulting. In today's video, I will be showing you how to use the Receivables Transaction Unapply tool in Dynamics GP. The RM Transaction Unapply tool is part of a larger tool set called Professional Services Tool Library, or PSTL for short. The PSTL is now a standard feature in GP that has many valuable tools that were once only available to Microsoft support or your implementation partner. Before using any of these tools, be sure that you are logged in as SA, as some of the tools require it, and make a backup of your company database. If you use Dynamics GP AR module, you are probably aware of a routine called paid transaction removal. This is a standard routine that you need to run if you want to move your paid invoices and or fully applied credit memos and payments to history so that they no longer show a status of open. Unfortunately, running this routine has its disadvantages. The big disadvantage is that the standard apply window where you can apply, unapply, and reapply payments and credits to invoices only sees documents that are still open. So if you have a document in history that you later realize has the wrong of payment or wrong credit memo applied to it, you can unapply the payment. You cannot unapply the payment and apply it to another invoice. Now you, now you can with receivables transaction unapply. So let's navigate to the PSTL setup right here. And then in the sales slash tools section, we see RM transaction unapply. So we choose that and click next. First, you'll want to choose the customer ID of the invoice or invoices that you're looking to unapply. I'm just going to choose Aaron Fitz Electric here as an example. And here you see work open and history. I'm just going to show history just to show what this would look like if you wanted to unapply historic documents. But from this window, I'm able, I'm able to uncheck a box in the applied column here. And it'll ask if I want to unapply it. You click unapply. And unapplying on all levels means just the payment or the payment and the invoice it applies to. So unapply all. And then you get a report. Um, so once you've run that, once you've done that, you are now able to take that payment and or invoice and apply it to new payments or invoices. For more information, please visit our website at www.loganconsulting.com or contact us via email at info at loganconsulting.com or via phone at 312-345-8800.